Join me as I break down the insane details of the $150 million fight between Canelo and Crawford and see if I can predict the winner. Canelo Alvarez, the Mexican superstar, and Terence Crawford, the American phenom, are on a collision course for the fight of the century. The hype surrounding this bout is real, folks, with both fighters boasting incredible resumes and a hunger for victory that can't be denied. Canelo, the four-division world champion, is looking to prove he's the best pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the world, while Crawford is determined to show the world he's the real deal. The road to victory won't be easy for either fighter, though. Canelo's got a challenge on his hands, facing an opponent who's never been knocked down or out in his entire professional career. Crawford's got the skills to take Canelo down, but he'll need to overcome his own struggles with inconsistent competition and lackluster performances in recent years. Then there's the weight class, with Canelo historically struggling at 154 pounds and Crawford potentially having the speed and power advantage at 147. Add in the lingering effects of Canelo's shoulder injuries and Crawford's history of hand problems, and you've got a recipe for a fight that's anyone's game. Crawford's speed and agility could be the key to outmaneuvering Canelo's relentless pressure, but Canelo's got the power to end the fight with one shot. Crawford's shown flashes of brilliance against lesser opponents, but can he replicate that success against the best of the best? Canelo's got the experience and ring IQ to adapt to any situation, but will he be able to overcome Crawford's southpaw stance and unorthodox style? The uncertainty is what makes this fight so enticing, folks. Each fighter's style is a study in contrasts, with Canelo's brutal bodywork and Crawford's slick, quick-footed boxing. Canelo's got the advantage in terms of pure punching power, but Crawford's got the edge in terms of hand speed and footwork. We've seen Canelo struggle against fighters who can take his power and keep coming forward, but we've also seen him dominate opponents with his excellent ring generalship. Crawford, on the other hand, has shown a tendency to start slow and get stronger as the fight wears on, but can he overcome Canelo's patented late-round surges? The experts are divided on the outcome, with some predicting a Canelo knockout and others foreseeing a Crawford upset. Crawford's trainers believe he's got the skills to outbox Canelo and win by decision, while Canelo's camp is confident he'll be able to wear Crawford down and stop him late. One thing's for sure, though, this fight is all the ingredients of a boxing classic. The stakes are high, the tension is palpable, and the world is waiting with bated breath to see who'll emerge victorious. So, what do you think, folks? Can Canelo prove he's the best in the world, or will Crawford pull off the upset of the century? Let me know in the comments below, and be sure to check out my other videos for more boxing analysis and predictions.